Arizona Diamondbacks taking on the St. Louis Cardinals. Alongside Chris Singleton, I'm John Shelby. And Chris, we've got an opportunity to watch one of the true superstars of the sport. Paul Goldschmidt. Always exciting to see him in action. And it seems like he consistently finds a way to impact the game. Yeah, Michaelis, man, you ain't starting out so good. Off the mark there, and we are underway. Ten and six record. We do, we're doing good. We're doing good. And the one zero. I got a ball, one strike. Pulls that one foul. Got a major breaking news update. Got my team, the virtual digital game, decided this to, third. to trade away over to our first. prospect, our top prospect, Jordan Walker, Time to take a look at for a starting pitcher. Facing a guy but why, why trade away Walker? Doesn't issue a lot of walks, so they're just didn't make sense to me. And when you've got a strike thrower like this guy on the mound, just didn't make sense to me. Overly patient as a hitter because the umpire is generally going to give him the benefit of the doubt. So you got to go up there, understand oh. what's in his repertoire, be aggressive in what you can handle. And you get three swings, why not take all three of them? With his control and command, he's going to be in the strike zone. And that is cut on and missed. And that's strike one. Oh, that's a dangerous pitch. Let's get that down a little. Yep, that's that's the spot. And the righty deal. Oh my god. That one mm, misses. Come on. And the count's even at two. It's a good take. One down, base is empty. Spoils the two-strike pitch, and he'll see another. Bounce to the left side. Arenado, man, you're getting some action. Good ground or two. That's what a good sinker is designed to do. Get a guy to roll over a little bit, hit the ball on the ground, kill some worms while you're at it. Two outs, base is empty. Next I'll be killing some worms today. He's hitting for that pop. Came out of the gates really strong. Guriel gets a piece. Michaelis, multi-time all-star. He features a four-seam fastball, a slider, a sinker, a curve, and he works in a changeup. There's a swing and a miss. Another 0-2 count right here. Pitcher just in the driver's seat. He can go anywhere he wants to go right here. Popped up. Donovan drifts towards it. And that is a that. good 1-2-3. One, 1-2-3 two, three. One, two, three inning in the first. 1-2-3. Go to Diamondbacks. And Let's get our bat going here early. Shot at it here. No score. It's Major League Baseball and it's on the show. that you may think well they're elite pitchers that are pitching sub twos they're dominating but when you can have that kind of consistency you know you have a chance to win the ball game every time he takes the mound so you know good season last year opportunity for him to go out there and repeat it this year possibly even improve but i tell you what if this guy's pitching for me and i'm playing in the outfield i'm loving every minute of it Next pitch is outside. Ah, 
not jammy. Sends it to first. One gone, bottom half of the first. Now we take a check of the St. Louis Cardinals lineup. And one of the most exciting young stars in the sport, Lars Newtbar. And Boog, he's a fun at bat to watch. I mean, definitely a threat whenever he's got that bat in his hands. But for me, it's it's all about the mechanics. They're so sound. And when he gets his foot down on time and starts his swing, so much consistency, that bat stays in the zone for a long time, and he squares up the baseball a lot. Now, Lars Newtbar, man, he has power. When he connects, he connects. The wine of the pitch. And now it's even up. Cardinals, man, they know how to get good prospects. They know how to get good draft picks and all that, man. The wind and the pitch. Two balls, two strikes. Swing Jammed again. It's like I got a drop. Going after it. Drops into the glove. Two down. Batting third. The first base. Paul Goldsmith. Now it's Goldsmith up to the plate. Obviously a guy who makes good contact, hits for average. But one of the things in today's game, the value in the fact that he hits both righties and lefties. Here's Ooh. a high fly ball out to center. Fletcher going back on this one. That yeah, is good wood on that, man. Redbirds down quietly. Scoreless after one. And a pitch. That's off the mark. And that's ball one. You know, Christian Walker, a guy who had a really successful amateur career, his college ball with the South Carolina Gamecocks, they won the College World Series twice with Walker. And he tied the College World Series record for most career hits with 28. Ed Drummond, our umpire behind the plate in this one. Yeah, Boog, he's a really fair umpire, both the pitchers and the hitters. So standard strike zone, he's consistent with it. And the great thing is you don't see Man, he went. question the calls too much. So that's a good thing in this day and age. Next offering is in for a strike. How much were you aware of the umpire scouting report or even who was going to be umpiring? Not a whole lot. I mean, there were a couple of umpires that weren't real good. But outside of that, you just kind of went into the game, especially back when I was playing. Next pitch misses, and now it's three and two. As the game has moved along, we see more and more information supplied by teams about the umpires. Oh, that I had you. Houses ...where they have pictures of all four guys, nicknames, hometowns, and as well hobbies listed, just so you can kind of small talk the umpire a little bit <laughs> that's great you can see my boy out looking well, just thought you got walked on that inside fastball really locked him up and it's a hitter it's not typically what you're looking for you're trying to protect away and then in so you can be a little bit tardy with two strikes hard to tell if he was fooled or if he thought it'd be called a ball but either way that's a really nice pitch Next offering is downstairs. No score here in the second. Next offering is in for a strike. Kicks and deals. Gets a piece and stays alive. One, two now. He goes down. You take a seat, my boy. Frustrating back to back strikeout. Hitter, and I'm sure that's going to sit on him for a little while. You want to be ready to hit the fastball. Sometimes you can overthink things, and I think that was the case right there. Now, Emmanuel Rivera. Check swing on the first pitch. Appeal down to first. No swing. Okay, okay. Clyde Washington with the call there. The 1 0. On the ground to the left, and foul ball. Go, 
Next offering is down low. Nope. And there's Damn. Three balls, one strike. Hit on the ground to the right side. Dives, but it kicks off his glove. That's Have plenty of time. 46 speed. Diamondbacks down quickly. We'll go to Gold Glover right there. No score. Consciously sacrificing contact to deliver power. There's a strike. Yeah, his swing is so good. It's in the zone a long time. He gets the barrel to it a lot, and that produces more base hits. Pitch misses. Ball and a strike to Arenado. Singy, one of the things that's interesting is that guys really don't worry about swing and miss from an offensive standpoint anymore. So when you see somebody who contacts the ball, you, you sure miss, are hitting your you spot against Arenado, man. Absolutely. If he's doing damage now, if he's rolling over and, and grounding out. Hacks and misses. It's a strikeout. Yeah, that's pretty sick. Late cutting action to get that the swing is. and miss right there. The I mean, that's just really no hard fair. to account for as a hitter Go when you're seeing right, the right, fastball right. all the way and then just at the last moment, it darts away from okay, you. At least make contact. Wilson Contreras now up to the plate. Didn't play in the day game yesterday, so he should be fresh for this one. Hey, when I throw it out there, you didn't call it a strike. Here's your one. Now wanted a one. Wilson Contreras has put together a pretty special career. Multiple times he's been an all-star and a guy that came up in the cup system as an infielder. That's out to center field. Fletcher makes the grab for the second out. I'm in a little off, getting jammed a little. Here's Nolan Gorman. This lineup's going to have to find a way to make him work a little harder out there on the mound. I mean, he is just mowing them down. He's settling in. You've got to make him uncomfortable. Maybe step out of the box, call timeout, do whatever it takes. Righty delivers. Strike. That was the, Looks like he's just that was the pitch. Him up there. Really good pitch to hit, but he took it all the way. Sometimes guys just want to set their timing later on in the game. That may be a pitch that he turns on. Out to short. And the inning is over. Nothing doing there for St. Louis. We'll move to the third with no score. Five years old. A former first round pick back in 2019. They say it went. Oh, and one. The why to kick the pitch. That one down the line, and he grabs it in foul ground. Jammed him, jammed him a bit. Going back inside. Going two now. Are you kidding me? You still making contact? Edmund puts it away. One away. Nick Ahmed here to hit. You talk about elite defensive players, especially in the middle of the diamond, and this guy is at the top of the list. In there for strike one. Yeah, we go beyond just the you know fielding percentage and you know what it looks like, but the ability to have a range and you know close holes that you know are normally there against an average defender. But this guy is special, and you can see it in his. First oh, now you giving me calls down there. pitch stays mm. alive 
Top of the third, no score. Next offering is foul back. Okay, okay, he's squaring up on it. Riding to the plate. Good oh. eye right there. Hoog, and the one thing about that is speed never goes in a slump, and defense shouldn't either. Hitting wise, you can struggle, you can lose your mechanics, but the thing that you can what? do consistently every single game is play great defense if you're talented in that way. And this Why is are you making contact does. on everything. And here it comes. Wet. Up the middle. Over to Goldie. First two batters retired here in the top of the third. The catcher, Don Merolio. Next to hit for Arizona, Don Merolio. Trying to pick up his first knock in the big leagues. Oh, you newbie. You are rookie. Fought off foul. Next offering is finally getting your MLB debut, huh? You're down 0 2, my buddy. I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna welcome you to the big league. Welcome to the MLB, buddy. Welcome to the big league. You just got struck out. Get it on. See if you can get a stolen base. Maybe get around the bases and pick up a run. And that one wrapped foul. You know, these D-backs, as this game goes on, have to be more disciplined at the plate. They're chasing a lot of pitches outside the zone, and those chases that are turning into a bunch of outs, can they turn that around and stay within the uh, zone? I almost got you we'll caught see, looking. I think they have to. In the air, left field. Yepes has a beat on it. One I got away with that pitch. <laughs> got away with it. Second base. An outstanding hitter in Cattell Marte. He's 0 for 1. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Ball one, no strike. There's a strike. And a one, two. Got him. You take a seat, my boy. Chase the fastball up the ladder for strike three. That was a pretty good pitch. Top of the strike zone. We're seeing more fastballs in that location. Hitters, especially with two strikes, have to be ready to pull the trigger. Here's Guriel. 0 for 1 with a fly out. And that's in there for strike one. Okay, okay. So I'm all over the place. They say you went. No Got you chasing. He went. Yes, he did. Down Sit down, my boy. Says Clyde Washington. That's a strikeout. Nothing doing for Arizona. Still no score. Oh snap, we're both hitless. I just 
Now the right hander ready to go. Still no score. Up the middle. Ahmed gets it to first. And one gone in the fourth as they get the leadoff man. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Let's the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. And here's Paul Goldschmidt. Lied out his first time. Chris Paul Goldschmidt has turned into a really good player for a guy who was an eighth round pick in 2009 at a Texas State. Many all star appearances, silver sluggers, and then in 2022, no. an MVP. Why? And, popped up. and they get Goldschmidt for the out. And there are two down. Now, bad at the third baseman, third baseman. Nolan. Nolan. All right. Here's Nolan Arenado. Scoreless here, but now he's got to deal with a guy who's got some power. Got to be careful when you're talking about a hitter with this type of slug and these type of home run totals. That misses the zone, and that is ball one. To the right side. Base hit. Sneaks through. Base Jan hit. base hit. Okay. And that gives Wilson Contreras a chance to hit with two out. Well, his hot hitting continues. He's been getting great results lately. Just a simple ground ball the other way that had eyes on him, man. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Just let the ball travel, put the ball in play, and just hope it finds a hole. And now let's see if they force some action with good wheels on the bases. Two outs, runner at first. And up to hit is Wilson Contreras. He's over one. Arenado leads off first with two down to the inning. That pitch in for a strike, and the count is one and one. Ah, Stop come on. His foul back. The one two and now two and two two ball two strike out to short Ahmed gloves it and that will end you got to be kidding me so one hand is all they get out of the top of the fifth we go we're tied nothing nothing Michaelis back to work and a good fastball to start him off at strike one pretty impressive we haven't seen that pitch from him much but he's got a really good feel when he throws it Next offering upstairs. Really good take, especially with two strikes. That misses the mm, He didn't want to bite on that. And now the count filled up three and two. That's a really good take right there. Slider down and in. Very difficult to get on the same plane and do anything with. Payoff pitch. Keeps the at-bat going with a foul ball. The pitch. Swing and a pop up. Get there. Calls it in, and there's one away. And now the shortstop, Nick Ahmed, grounded out his first time. Ahmed. Oh, oh no, no, don't be calling it a ball now. You've been calling it a strike. And he was a second round pick. Back in 2011. 
The next pitch misses. Ball two. He's been raking in recent games, and a big reason why getting ahead in counts. He's been able to do that consistently, and you see the results. Swing and a ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. Some really nice patience in that. Through five innings with no hit. Simple played Pepper with the middle of the infield and took it back where it came from, and there's just no one there to knock it down. And now a chance to maybe get creative on offense with good speed on first. Run around at first with one gone. Next up for the Diamondbacks, Dom Marolio. And that one fouled off. Oh. Line drive, base hit. Lead runner touches second, headed for third. The relay, he's in there. Dom Marolio with his first major league hit, and this is a moment I'm sure he'll never forget. Congrats. Yeah, great moment for him and his family. A guy works so hard and has to wait so long for this to happen, and when it does, it can kind of be overwhelming. Dude. You still have to stay locked in on the game, but it's great when you can take a minute to just appreciate what you've done and how hard you worked to get here. So the batting order turns over, and now the right fielder, Jake McCarthy. In there, and it's 0-1. Well, all eyes on the double play ball in this spot. No better way to get out of this inning. Two on, one out. Nope. You called out a ball last time. I mean, a strike last time. Get the ball in on the plate so that he can't get the barrel to it and hit it to the outfield. Right-hander kicks deal. Strike three. Really going after him here. All fastballs to get ahead in the count. Kicks and fires. To short, could be two. Edmund, quickly to second for one. To first, not in time. And a run scores. I promise you, there are guys that get a little bit faster when they can smell an RBI. That was a possible inning ending double play. Great hustle, and he gets rewarded with the RBI because of it. Here's Cattell Marte. There's a strike. Come on, Cardinals, and a pitch. In the air out to center. O'Neal getting an angle on it. And that will end the inning. All right, and just one run. run on two All right. Hits, no errors and the man left. 9-1-2 scheduled to hit in the home half of the six. It's the Diamondbacks one and the Cardinals nothing. And a pitch. There's a strike. 0-1. Come right on. Side. Marte picks it up. One up, one down. Now Tommy Edmond at the plate. He's supposed to lift that pitch. And first offering is fouled off. Pitch. Oh, you kidding me? Right Why am I not getting good contact? McCarthy makes the catch. Two away now. Maybe caught that one off the end just a little bit. Couldn't quite barrel it up enough to really drive it. Brendan Donovan, the next to hit. Check swing. He went. And it's 0 and 1.
Wouldn't chase that time. The why the kick of the one two. And that's downstairs and outside. That one back up the middle. Okay, okay. Through. And it stays alive. Two out rally here. It's possible. Two out rally. Get the rally cap going. So far tonight, Boog. So I don't think that one will disrupt his momentum all that much. You know, he's really been on top of his game, commanding his pitches all night long. Here's Paul Goldschmidt. In there for strike one. Goldie, in his 12th season, over 1,000 runs batted in in his career, and he's a former National League MVP. Next pitch inside at one and one. Good eye in that spot. Being extra careful against this guy. I would too. Swings and chases a low one there. Well, and those hitters count sometimes can be a little too aggressive and a good pitcher will play off of that. He's got to get a better pitch to hit. Kicks and deals. Swing and a miss struck him out. The high heat too much on that one. One hit, one left. Seventh inning coming up. It's the Diamondbacks one and the Cardinals nothing. basically helping him out the why to kick the pitch yeah. and that's in for a strike A strike. Oh, this guy's so comfortable hitting with two strikes, even a good pitch early in the at bat. If he's not ready to pull the trigger, he's not worried if he gets to an 0 2 count. Should be worried. And now the lefty. Wow, that's a tough pitch to lay off. And here it comes. Bro. Well, he might have to look for a different put away pitch right here, too, too. He's already seen the curveball a couple of times in this at bat, so might have it timed up and ready for it. Swings. Take a seat, my boy. Couldn't catch up to the heater. Good late cut for the strikeout there. That oh, thing really the got in on him. And, you know, the cutter isn't really a huge swing and miss pitch most of the time because it's not really meant to move a whole lot. You're just trying to miss the big part of the barrel and maybe get some weak contact. But that one right there did a whole lot more than that. That was a really good pitch. On the ground, Edmund collects. Tosses to first and two away to start the seven. Up next to the diamond, the left field. This is Corbin Carroll. Slice the other way. That's a base hit. Makes the turn and heads for second. The throw in. Not in time. He's got wow. He quickly went from hitter to base runner. Love when guys make that transition, and he's got speed to put on a show. I almost got you. So 
two down. Emmanuel Rivera will hit next. First pitch just misses. All one, no strike. Man at second. Swing and a base hit. Carroll headed for the plate. He scores, and they take a two-run lead. Rivera into second, and he's got a double. Well, Singy, he is locked in there. Well, he's really slowed the game down, and it's like he's moving in full speed, and everybody is a step or two behind. The way that he squared up that baseball tells me that he is seeing it like a beach ball. Man at second here with two away. Next to hit for Arizona, Dominic Fletcher. First offering misses the mark. Left hand hitter waits. Swing and a miss. Runner at second, two down. Bro. Foul ball, he stays alive. And a ball in two strikes. Got him. Good All right. job of damage control right there. D-backs with a run. Now we just need some late inning magic. You're watching Major League Baseball exclusively on the show. Talk about the right guy at the right spot. They really need a rally, and this guy is someone you can believe in to find a way to get on base. Here's a 1-1. One -one. And it's fouled away. The one, two. Two balls, two strikes. Come on, Clark, now let's go. Ooh, okay. A base hit into left field. So a man on base. I thought he was going to snatch, snatch that from me. Those are the types of hits where you don't feel any vibration in your hands whatsoever. Such a good feeling. That pretty much split the zone down the middle, and those are the ones where you got to make them pay. Now the third baseman, Nolan. You can't make nobody pay when it's down the middle. We, your ground out, pop up, whatever. This guy is at the top of the list. And that's in the dirt. Ball one. And now two and nothing. Oh, an interesting situation. One swing, you can tie up the ball game. But if you're patient and work a walk, then you bring the game-winning run to the plate. The pitch. And downstairs. Rio. Wilson, Wilson Contreras. 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 You can win it for us. Nobody out. And a four pitch walk. That could jumpstart an offense that's really struggled to score in this one. Alright, no outs. Two on. Let's cap on this. Second. No outs. Digging in. Wilson Contreras. This is a guy who is very highly regarded defensively. Fun to watch him control stuff behind the plate. Good game caller, good at framing, but it's that big arm that really stands out. Inside, Pitch misses inside, and yeah, that's ball one. Trying to keep the game alive here in the bottom of the ninth. And now it's even up. All right, good circle change. 
I'm glad you did not make contact. Swing and a miss. As he was out front that time. Next pitch misses. And the count is even two and two. Check swing. In the dirt, but kept close. Well, he clearly didn't recognize that curveball. We're blind up. And, and tried to check the swing, just went around too far, and you're hoping the umpire maybe missed it, and they bail you out. Nolan Gorman next up for the Cardinals. At the dish, looking to lift the ball in the air in this spot. Anything but the inning, inning double play, boo. That was the pitch. Well, he missed a hittable off-speed pitch right there. Not sure exactly with the timing. Sometimes you get a backup breaking ball. You're expecting it to make its move at the end. It never does. And you're tied up. Oh, Next cool. offering is downstairs. Got him swinging for the strikeout. Pulled the string on the changeup. You know, variant speeds can be just as useful for a pitcher as movement. As you see right there, it really wasn't a great location. But the fact that the velocity change had the hitter off balance, and that's all you got to do sometimes. Here's the left fielder, Juan Yepes. I, I, I wanted to. Two run game with two I should have swung, maybe, maybe. And now the count is even. Come on, you need to come up clutch. Get a base hit here. And that's really base hit. Base Stay. Or not. The Off throw. Doesn't off matter. And he's score. And a 2-1 ball game now. Such great concentration. Everybody on their feet. Knowing that you can come through with a good swing. And there he doesn't try to do too much. Now on the mound for the Diamondbacks. Miguel Castro. And I can't imagine any save is an easy one. You're holding a small lead on the scoreboard. And you know those hitters are going to give you the best at bats they can. So... It's always high stress. Let's see what he's got here to try and close it out. And up next for St. Louis, Tyler O'Neill. Trying to deliver as the hero. First pitch, not close. Crowd locked in right now. One Sinker, one slider, and a changeup. Okay. on a line to center he's got it ball game and the Diamondbacks hold on to win a tight one as this one ends as a one run ball game well all you want is a chance going to that final frame they got some base runners had the tying run at second the winning run at first just couldn't come through with the big hit on the other side nice job to battle through it close out the win he tried we definitely tried TNT Dynamite Gamer Like, comment, subscribe See y'all in the next video Peace